Okay, you're back with the Passion Fruit Walrus. Uh, we are carrying on with this uh, mission to defeat the Protoss and try not to get eaten by the Zerg. Uh, let's see, there's still not very much we can do just yet. And they're gobbling through those crystals pretty fast. <laughs> First Protoss. <laughs> you want a piece of me, boy? It's strange how the computer will send like one of them against you in this in this campaign kind of thing. It's kind of weird. There you go. Have a squad of 12, then we're going to go and we're going to capture a resource area over here. You want a piece of me, boy? Mm. Might be some more defenses there. Most we'll of the attacks are coming from here as well. Maybe I'll put another bunker in by there. Always waiting. So, so let's continue our reading from last time. Uh, although religions were officially banned by the UPL, the organization held an almost zealous belief in the supposed divinity of mankind. This quasi-religious uh, dogma called for the immediate eradication of any non-vital prosthetics or mutations amongst the pure strain human gene pool. Hardline UPL proponents and scholars argued that genetic alterations, cyber technology and the use of psychoactive drugs all led to the eventual degradation of the human species. The UPL leaders formulated a bold plan that would assure that humanity would persevere unscathed by the Tempting corruption of radical technologies. And now I've got my squad of 12. I'm going to go and find some more resources. And let's get a couple more of those on the go. And along with them. Can't do anything with that yet. Can bump that up. And get that on the go too. Okay. And yes, sir. Yeah, I need some more troops to go in there. I could just nick Check these guys. Yes, right. sir. Does leave Carrigan a little on the vulnerable side? Maybe I'll move her I down here. And let's bring a tank down here. Um, right, I think I want to. Hmm. Let's get my command center up first, and then I'll start fortifying. Come on, we need 400. Hey, 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 hey! Research complete. There we go. Right, so I don't think I'll uh, look too closely at uh, what's in here because they, uh, the siege tanks might take a few pot shots and I lose the game if I damage a building, which is ridiculous. Right along here we've got one of the Protoss bases. These are Dragoons and these are Zealots. 
Um, that's all that's on display really, apart from buildings. Right, uh, want more troops, of course. Not enough minerals. Yeah, there is. Destination moving. Right, down here. I don't know if I need another Report tank right here or not. Really. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You want a piece of me, boy? Okay then. Waiting for that then at the moment. Uh, I could get a couple more of these SCPs building. The Great Purification. Like the bloody inquisitions that devastated Europe 800 years before, the UPL set in motion one of the harshest agendas ever conceived by humanity, Project Purification. Destination. Uh, let's pop this up here now. Okay. One of those. You want a piece of me, boy? The genocidal crusade was the government's final solution to the matter of cleansing humanity of its more degenerate facts, facets. UPL troops scoured every nation on Earth, rounding up dissident hackers, synthetics, and cybernetically enhanced tech pirates. Oh, the cybernetically enhanced tech pirates and criminals of every kind. So slow with the bloody resources, it really is. Four of those in there. Okay. This planet wide culling uh, resulted in the eradication of nearly 400 million people. media, now under the strict control of the UPL, downplayed the horrific violence and kept the general populace of Earth unaware of the scope of the atrocities being committed. How many more do I need here? Six. Lots and lots of damage. Additional supply depots required. Oh, okay. More bloody supply depots. Come on then. You go and build some of those. I can't do anything with that yet. Right. These guys can go over here. This one down to support that bunker because if this is their only way down. They're probably not really going to get to, to that one. Uh, right, so. Let's have a little scout about. In fact, I can use this as well. Right. Okay, so I need a bunker around here. Okay, good. And this guy can move up to there. And there are a few of these guys. But not that one. Uh, let's put them there for now. Yes, sir. 
Two more. And how are we doing? Right, let's get a couple more of those. Need another supply depot. And get some more troops on the go. And I'm going to need to build a science um, thingy. Good, then you can come and build me a science thingy. Oh, but not until I've done this star port and the other thing. Uh, do we need the star port up here? Your forces yeah, are not really. Probably not really going to use it for anything anyway. Once they're out, they can support my infantry down there. I will build a um, a science vessel when I've got the uh, the spaceport up and running, and the uh, the sciencey bit too. Twelve, no, one here. That's fine. Okay. Scan a bit more. Is it more there? Okay. Actually, yes, I will be using the, the Star Fort. I need drop ships. Okay, and the science facility. Can go down here. Done with that, then I need to get a command center here so that I can start mining that gas. You want a piece of me, boy? Give me some to shoot. And I think he can go back up here in case we get attacked by here again. More tanks, always a good idea. Complete. You want a piece of me, boy? Couple more drop ships. Okay. Despite their heinous acts, the UPL succeeded in advancing many core technologies. Fields of research that had lain dormant for decades were opened again under UPL control. Good. Uh, <coughs> physics lab, I think. Uh, what one of them as well? Maybe two. Uh, you can carry on just doing some uh, mining. They can wait there for a bit. In order to build up some troops, then I'm going to do an air assault against this Protoss base. The space exploration programs of the mid-20th century abandoned by the American and Russian governments due to drastically reduced budgets and incessant political sabotage became the basis for a new era of exploration for hum of exploration for humanity. Maybe a couple more. And I think one. Yeah, I need some more of these. Got four drop ships then. Mm -hmm. The coupling of cryogenic hibernation with warp drive technology resulted in the ability to travel on, among the stars. Base is under attack. Within the span of 40 years, the UPL founded colonies upon the Moon and many other, other planets within the Terran solar system. So, I want eight of these in here. Additional supply depots required. Oh, of course they are. And we want them up there. 
and yeah, supply defense, right, okay. Um, I need a little minion. Just a little minion. Input coordinates. Go ahead, HQ. Orders, sir. So we get our tanks in here, and we'll do the overlapping waves of siege tanks like before uh, with infantry support. I want about 16 of the marines to back me up. I think I'll probably get some. Um, Goliaths as well. Right, so that's going. We'll get one of them later. Right, so how are we doing with that? Uh, down here. More space. Space again. Goody. Another resource area. Scan anything here? Yes, I can. Another Protoss base. Okay, and um, we got still need another one. I'll just pump out a bunch more. Right, and I need to build. Where's my little chap? I need to build a armory or oh, an armory, even. Get up there for the next load of troops. Upgrade complete. Okay. You want a piece of me, boy? Drop them by there, and then I'll organize it some down. What's way here? Couple of troops. Okay, dropships come back, and I want my mm, Goliaths. Upgrade our weapons, get more fucking infantry. And I can do is sending a builder up there as well, so I think he might end up getting conscripted. Mm, they can go there, I think. Let's have that. Uh, yeah, why not? And uh, another depot. Destroyed yet? Good, right, so that one and um, that one. Move your asses forward. Guys, move forward. Come on. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right. How we do? Right, so we got our eight. We want that. Nice time. Got the last guy. Okay. Do that in a minute. Destination. 
Okay, get them back there. Keep the unit production going. Um, could just whack another punk, uh, barracks in there as well. Get my Goliaths. Drop them in there. Keep sword. Fairly weak defense by the Protoss, sort of relatively. Okay, good. Okay, do you want any of these things? Well. Kind of a waste I could do. Get a couple of them on the go. Uh, uh, let's build some more depots over here. A couple more of uh, those. Okay. These guys are all going to go up to where that Protoss base is, but not until we've cleared it. Have to kill the natives first. So they're ready to go. Boost our weapons again. Uh, keep up the unit production. Okay, right. Take sword. Okay, I think most of their defense has crumbled now. Seeing as we don't seem to be getting much of an enemy uh, response, I'll build a command center and then move it forward, I think. But I will do that in the next part, so thank you for watching, and bye-bye for now.